Hi there and welcome to Lindy Irving Empowerment Coaching for Women with me, Lindy Lou. And today we're talking about why it's sometimes important to look beyond first impressions because we're always being told that it's super important to make a first impression and that you don't get a second chance to make a first impression. And of course that, that's true and it can be true, but it's also important, I think, that we sometimes try and look beyond that and the reason this has come up is because I was doing a funeral the other day and I was standing outside the service room sort of welcoming everybody as they arrived and it was a very busy funeral so the room was already really busy and there were people standing up there's no seats left so uh, quite a daunting environment to walk into in the first place and there were two ladies standing outside chatting to each other and um, I think they were waiting for somebody but then this man came up the stairs on his own and when he walked past me in the service room I heard one woman say to the other oh you would think he would have made an effort to come to a funeral and the reason that they said that was I had watched the man coming up the stairs as I'd watching everybody and his, his clothes were maybe not as well presented as they could have been his trousers weren't ironed as well as they could have been and his shirt was a sort of off-white colour and his hair looked a wee bit dishevelled but to me that man probably had made more of an effort than most of the people that were in that room because if you took a second glance at that man you could see he was sweating he looked so uncomfortable and like the last Thing he wanted to be doing was walking into that room. Now, I know it's a funeral, nobody wants to be walking into the room, but I think it was beyond that. I like to think, and having worked with people for over 10 years and been an observer of people, that I can tell when somebody maybe has issues of their own. I know we all have issues, but that some people have issues and they have anxiety issues and they maybe even have mental health issues. and that man looked as if he was so far outside his own comfort zone and he was having to step into that environment and yet he, he was there. He was able to see beyond or, or move beyond his own, his own fears, his own anxieties, his own issues to come out and pay his respects and his reward for that, if you like, was to be judged by other people who were just basing their their um, their judgments on those first impressions and I've talked about this in videos before where you, if you, you find yourself looking at somebody and, and making a negative judgment in your head is to question that and, and I just want to compound that I just want to, to keep adding to that because I think it's so important because I think we all do it we do make snap judgments and, and, and often it comes from something deep rooted in our psychology but that that's not an excuse to let it run wild what we need to do is to stop that in its tracks and and to question ourselves not beat ourselves up but just to question ourselves why am i thinking that why did i assume because their assumptions were that that man was lazy hadn't made an effort couldn't be bothered whatever it might be when actually it was to me the opposite of that and so if perhaps if they had stepped in if she'd stepped in and said oh you know I shouldn't have said that what was I thinking that for you know I don't know what's going on in that man's life therefore I shouldn't make any judgments I should focus my attention on myself and how I can become a better person and let me tell you message you can become a better person by not judging other people so ladies if you find yourself in a situation where you're making snap judgments then just try and question that and if you're with friends and they're making snap judgments then try and question them and let's try and put a stop to this and, and remember life's not about being perfect it's about trying your very best and if you're someone who finds yourself in situations where you might feel judged then please remember that if that is the case then that's not about you it's about that other person and for every 
one person that might make judgments based on first impressions. There is a whole load of people like me who will always have your back. So I hope that's been helpful. Have a great weekend, whatever you're doing, and I will see you very soon.